I just want to show you this beautiful journal. I've had it for a while, but um, sometimes I just like to show things again. Yeah. I won't talk too much. I want it to be more like an ASMR. So. ribbon and the little flowers there's all sorts of um, fabric and lace trims velvet trims wow beautiful pocket and I love that crazy stitching there with all bits of different fabrics and here we've got so this was made um, by Debbie from DW Fabrics and I think she is that on Etsy as well that's her own drawing how talented is she so she made this as a custom order for me years ago it's a shame she didn't write down when um, at least three years old I'd say this is definitely one of my favourites. It's just a little bit cut off, but not much. Because, uh, oh wow, look at that. I just can't move it. For some reason. Look at that. How cool is this? Beautiful. And she's made a channel. I mean, some lovely book pages. Oh wow, Beatrix Potter. Love that. Really like that. Um, the music paper and gift wrapping paper. I think it might be. And then I love that. Look at that, beautiful. Wow, music paper with some stenciling and some spraying, oh wow, got some vintage old lace, beautiful embossed envelope, for anyone that doesn't know I um I used to collect journals. I still do. I've actually got a, a current one in the making that's coming from Canada. It's a spiritual one. Look at this. How cool is that? And Sarah's journals is making it for me. She is so talented. How beautiful is that? And over here it flips over like a little um, envelope too. No, I can't. I tried to get it to zoom out a bit. I think it did a little bit, yeah. Look at that. Flips over. Beautiful, beautiful paper there. And I love that here, how it's holding that old ledger together. Wow. Love that, that ledger there and the fussy cut images and There's the middle. Oh, that must have 
fallen out of here. I'd say that was in there. How beautiful is that? Oh, this way. Oh, like a little um. Mm. Oh look. image there that opens up like that beautiful Look at that. oh that's stuck so pretty wow look at that absolutely love that how it goes Orange to yellow to green. Lovely bits of fabric. Beautiful collage right. Oh, it's like a little envelope. See, so you can have something in here. But I really like that, that image. So pretty. I like every page, honestly. Um, she she's really good with layering and um, like gen um, yeah. That she's done here. Cut little scraps and so that's her first signature there. Now you can see the second one. See all that drawing. Look at all that. Really pretty. Again. Little bird. Oh, I like that. Oh, wow. Look at that. Beautiful old ledger. And then here, like an old closet. Uh, with this beautiful little tag peeking out. Look at that. And here, look at this page. Beautiful. Ooh. Oh, there you go. You can put something in there too. Oh, that, that's wallpaper. I see. That's pretty. And I love the way she's done that with this fabric, the stitching, and over here, image. I did tell her I like images of um, Edwardian. That's why it's very Victorian kind of looking. Yeah, really love this. Love that thin texture there. Look at that. Beautiful. Love that pocket there she's made. Wow, she's used old book paper. I've, I used to do this too. It looks like binding from old vintage papers. And I love how it's sheer. Really love that. And, and look at that. How gorgeous. And you can smell it. Like the artwork. It's just really beautiful. DW Fabrics on Etsy. Tell her I sent Irene from Seriously Scrapping. And she will look after you. Tell her you want a journal like the one you made me. 
you'll probably give her a heart attack. <laughs> Poor girl. Is she, is she put in a lot of work? A really beautiful journal. Because um, I don't write in mine, so I always ask for my journals to be fully embellished. Look at that. How cute is that? There's a pocket here and here. Look, she does her own drawings. I love that. It's really pretty. Oh my gosh, how beautiful is this double page? So little prayer for me. Wow, beautiful. Really pretty. I've got some butterflies and a little Victorian Edwardian Bubba there. Look at that. That's really cute. I love that. Again, this lovely pocket with this um, wallpaper envelope. I love all that. My jam. Nice. Sparrow. Beautiful. I, I always find fledglings and end up raising them until they're old enough to fly away. Which is weird because I've got cats. So <laughs> it's a mission trying to keep it alive. Isn't that beautiful? The collaging work and um, she's got some stamping too and her own artwork here as well along there drawing yep. oh my gosh I love this page look how busy busy looking it is isn't it you just want to grab it you know and play with it I'm I think I must be ADHD because I just sensory overload, you know, I just have to touch everything. This is all hand drawn here. She's a true artist. This page, um, it's a watercolour page and she's tea dyed, dyed it and added. Yeah. But I really love how she's done this. I just it feels like it needs to be picked off but it, it doesn't open or anything it's a bit of a tease but um yeah I love it I love all that yeah just love touching it again this this is all collaged every little bit there wow Oh my, I love that. That orange button with this gold, the beige, the way they set off each other. And here as well, this little bit of writing there. Um, look, look at all these little bits of pieces. Isn't it amazing the way when they're put together, there's a little stamp there. And there's a bit of painting along the cardboard box there really love that and that as well looks hand stitched on some burlap that's a good idea because i've got burlap and i've got lots of this type of stuff as well that's so cute yes i definitely got lots of victorian images some beautiful lace Oh, look at that. That's definitely from Beatrix Potter, which um, Debbie Vanola, I know she loves Beatrix Potter. I really love that. Beautiful image of old books. Um, one of their pages here, where it's all decorated, and then it's stitched, and then I love how she's 
done this stencil with I don't know what that is but um, it's, I think it's like a paste like a gold paste it's really awesome texture paste yeah another one of her pages it's really pretty Oh wow. Oh look at that. What a beautiful page. Oh. So that is like a little pin. How beautiful is that? Love that. So, the wonderful language of flowers. How beautiful is that? Wow. That's 3D. See how she's done it 3D? Oh my gosh, how beautiful is that? And I love how she's added this in. She's stitched it it's from very old. 1955, Sanctuary Story. Penny Farthings are on parade on Angel Hill. January the 1st, 1909. The day that changed life of millions. The first day in 1909 was New Year's Day. It was also the day that was changed the lives of millions. It marked the introduction of the old age pensions. Oh. But this is from 1955. Wow, my mum was born in 54. Interesting. How beautiful is that? I love that. Look, she's got... Oh, I think that was supposed to stay going shut. But look at that. Little flowers, dried flowers. Like that. I love how she strengthens the pages as well with other collage type thing that I like that. Oh, that's a lovely piece of paper there. So collaging. Look, some lovely old lace. Yeah. There's the middle signature. Early work. Beatrix Potter, age nine. Oh, wow. Very pretty. Oh, wow. Those Victorian shoes. And look at those lovely trims. Beautiful. Oh, look at that. Um, what's that called? I forget. Love that. Oh, it's a pocket. Ooh. You can see why it's one of my favourites, but you know what? I say that with all of them. Um... I, I honest because I paid for every single one of them, yeah. So it wasn't given to me for free. So I'm not gonna pay for something I don't like. So naturally I'm just gonna love all of my journals. <clears throat> Are there ones that I would like a little more over others, perhaps? How beautiful is that? So there's one spot there, one spot there. Nice big page. Beautiful 
fabric to match the page there and that is from the 70s that is Balmoral Castle Royal D sign and then it's the other side of that really old paper both coats were very football Congratulations to the free pairs from Brahams. The oldest leading scrap iron metal merchants in East Anglia. Hmm. That's a little more. Oh, it's another little pocket and little messes. No cool. Oh wow. Toily. Toilet. T O I L E. Toil. I think it's cool. Love that. Little pocket thing. Oh, Beautiful. She's done that herself. And she's stuck. Love how she sticks sticks them like that. And that carries over on the other side there, this beautiful pocket she's made. Her drawing, a bit of fabric and image. See, you can see the the way she's reinforced it with um ooh, a bit of old paper there and some illustration book papers and old writing paper, sorry, meant to say. Oh wow. Love love all the different colours going on here. With the fabrics. Look at that. Gorgeous. Oh, wow. Isn't that beautiful? So that's the end of the book. Beautiful fabric butterfly, and I love that there. And over here, that is a very old antique, I think she told me, or close to. No, I think she said she made it to look antique. That is so cool. I really like that. And over here, oh, oh these are. Oh, even though um, they're plastic, they give off the illusion that they're cat eye. They're very good cat eye fakes or tiger's eyes. And that's a turquoise fake. But I really love the way she made this. Absolutely stunning. Look at this beautiful fabric padded tag with the toil fabric. Beautiful image. And then, oh, that's um, two different images. So that's been stuck over that. So you can see the edge there. And that is so cool. Peeking out the window. So yeah. And there's the back. Isn't that gorgeous? That. And the front. It's 
so pretty. Really love that. Love that. So beautiful. But this, oh my gosh, check that out. Gorgeous. And um, she gave me some of these leftovers that she was working on. Oh, see Daisy, they're all, all over the place. A few, a few bits you might like. Thanks, Debbie. So they must have, yeah, came out. But um, yeah. Handmade, some beautiful lace. Cats, no less. Oh, I think she knew I liked cats. I'll be the crazy cat lady one day. I was going to say old. I'm not old yet, but um. One day I will be the crazy old cat lady from Footscray. Oh wow, how beautiful are these? These are um, Beatrix Potter. And then they both got illustrations. It's come from a retro vintage book. And you've got some beautiful fabrics. Yeah, these are the beautiful sheer fabrics she used to make pockets. Wow. Beautiful. Oh, I really like this. Yeah. So, um, yeah, go on over and check her out. Um, I don't know who she is on YouTube. If I do find her, I'll put the links below. Okay, so that's her book there. I'll put it that way so it's not cut out. Thanks for watching. Bye.